For over a year, the Lost Hills Wonderful Park has been under construction, but now it's finally open. I'm Sam Hoyle, your Lost Hills neighborhood reporter. The county and the wonderful company holding a celebration on Wednesday morning in an effort to celebrate what's happening and the growth of this community. The project was partially funded by a Clean California grant and opened up right in time for the summer season. Several key members leading the project took time to speak to members of the Lost Hills community during a press conference on Wednesday morning as children played on in the background. 23 ABC spoke to several members of the Lost Hills community out at the park and they noted they never imagined seeing something quite like this in their hometown. Rosario Velasquez has lived in Lost Hills for four decades and plans to live there for the foreseeable future. The park for her signifies a change for the better in the community and provides a resource to her children that she wishes she had years ago. 40 years ago I did not have this kind of park for myself as a child to come and play. So for me to be able to bring my kids to this amazing structure, it's a life changing opportunity for my kids. I never honestly thought my community was going to grow any and it's become something very special where I don't want to move out of Lost Hills nor my kids. <laughs> Natalie Vasquez has lived in Lost Hills for 30 years and said the previous equipment at the park was dull and dismal. Now with vibrant color and a sprawling space, Vasquez said she and her children are excited to enjoy the space for years to come. It's just the same color as the sand, so I feel like it wasn't um, it wasn't bringing the attention to the kids. It was just like, oh, just this and that's it. Before it's like, there's not much things to do at the park, way before. But now it's like, I see my son's face like very excited and happy that we have something new in our town to enjoy with, with our kids. Now you can check out the new addition to this community. It's right off of the north side of Highway 46 as you're popping through Lost Hills. In Lost Hills, I'm Sam Hoyle, your neighborhood reporter.